Sources here in South Korea say North Korean troops in Russia have not yet been involved in full-scale combat against Ukraine. This follows reports that those troops have been killed after engaging in small-scale fights. Kim Bo-gyong has the latest. A South Korean presidential official said that North Korean troops in Russia have not yet engaged in full-fledged combat against Ukraine. However, they continued that if joint combat operations between North Korea and Russia do begin, South Korea could dispatch a monitoring team to get the full details on the ground to determine Seoul's security and collaboration with Kyiv. The official added that sending a small-scale team with a specific temporary mission is under the defense minister's authority and would not need parliamentary approval. Such remarks from the South Korean government came amid reports that North Korean troops engaged in a limited confrontation with Ukrainian forces. According to a senior U.S. official cited by local media on Tuesday, a significant number of North Korean troops were killed during their first fight in Russia's war against Ukraine. The report cited a Ukrainian official, also on the condition of anonymity, and added the engagement was limited, likely meant to probe Ukrainian lines for witnesses. Additionally, Ukrainian President Volodymyr Zelensky confirmed that North Korean troops had engaged in combat in his nightly address. He called it, quote, a new chapter of instability in the world. The first battles with North Korean soldiers open a new chapter of instability in the world. Together with the world, we must do everything to ensure that this Russian step toward expanding the war, toward real escalation, that this step of his becomes a losing one for him and for North Korea. These were in line with a recent interview of the Ukrainian defense chief by a South Korean local broadcaster, where he confirmed that the first battle with North Korean soldiers had already taken place on a small scale on Monday. He added up to 15,000 soldiers from North Korea are in Kursk, and that many of those troops would be involved in combat in the following weeks after training. Kim Bo-kyung, Arirang News.